Well, the state of New Jersey has now filed a two and a half million dollar lawsuit against Sig Sauer, claiming they received handguns that did not work properly. Now, here in Manchester, the police department also uses this company, and the chief here tells us they've never had an issue with them in the eight years that they've been using this company. Now, as for that lawsuit with the state of New Jersey, it is asking for a refund after the state says its state police received a shipment of P229 legacy handguns from Sig Sauer in the summer of 2014. Now, it claims the weapons failed to eject spent shell casings from the barrel of the guns after being fired. New Jersey State Police say they contacted Sig Sauer and after several attempts to fix the issue, it was determined there was an improper coating on the barrel of the guns. Now, Manchester Police Chief Nick Willard says his department has used hundreds of Sig Sauer guns and he was surprised to hear about the accusations. Sig Sauer makes it the premier weapon system in the world um, and their customer service is uh, above any other um, that we've dealt with as far as a vendor in any aspect of um, police service. So um, I, I think that it's unfortunate and Jersey State Police is claiming that they had the issue, um, but I'm sure when it's vetted out, uh, six hour will come out clean on it. And now the lawsuit went on to say the New Jersey State Police Department eventually returned all their handguns to Sig Sauer and went with a different gun company. Now we did reach out to Sig Sauer for comment on this lawsuit. However, they were not able to be reached for comment this afternoon. We are live here in Manchester. I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.